Roland. Roland! Yes, sister. Please come. All right, I'm coming. Please sit down. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. You look tired. Mm. I'm trying to do a thing or two inside the house, anyways. Okay. So you called. What's up? Yes. Please listen, okay? And be serious with it. Alright? Okay. Roland, I had a terrible dream about you last night. Oh, wow. And in this dream, someone shot you dead. Nikwa, dead. Roland, please be serious. Now, the strange thing about the dream is that the person who shot you dead is someone I've seen here before. This is a guy that came here one time talking about love and marriage. Hmm. What I'm saying in essence is, please try and be careful this period. Watch where you go to the people you hang out with. I beg you, Roland, please. Yeah, I beg you, sister. You're not even reacting like he's serious. Sister, I've heard you. I'm not looking for trouble. I'm just living my life as simple as it is. So I'm safe. I understand. But for the fact that Archippus is missing, I don't want anything to happen to you too. Please. All right, sister, I've heard you. I've heard you. Cheer up. I'm not going to die anytime soon. <laughs> You're stupid. Very, very stupid. <laughs> I'm not dying anytime soon, okay? I'll be fine. Thank you. Uh, have you? What's all this for now? Huh? <laughs> Would you let me pass, please? What is here? I've been telling you to stay away from that bullet. What? Are you, are you trying? What, you, you, want to, you, want to, you are what very are stupid to think something like that. Oh. What nonsense? Me stupid. I better let me pass, John. No problem. You will see stupid. You will see stupid now. <laughs> Have you seen your friend around? Oh, no. I haven't seen her all day. Probably she went out to see someone special. What do you mean someone special? Well, I mean, you know, we ladies don't like to stick with just one man. So, I guess she's with someone right now. You see, I am here for you. I'll call I, you her know... on the phone. I was so close. But next time, you would not get away from me. Hi, darling. You're Hi. welcome. Thank you. How Hi. was your day? Ah, it was very stressful. Yeah, yeah. Very stressful, but I'm, I'm better now. Okay. Sure. How are you? I'm good. <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Um, there's something very important I want to discuss with you. Okay, which is? Is Chantel inside? Mm, yes, she's inside. What about her? <laughs> I think Chantel has to leave. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I don't understand you. <laughs> what does that even mean? Listen, I don't... I don't know how to put this. I'm trying to use the right words. But please listen to me. Just give me a few seconds. I don't think her intention towards us is good. <laughs> There's a lot of things going on that I... 
No. She has to leave. No. Uh -uh. See, I understand you're not comfortable with Shanta living with us. Okay. But you don't expect me to abandon my friend. No, she stays. Cynthia. Cynthia. So you're saying that your relationship with Chantel is more important than saving your own relationship? Is that what it is? No. Please, let her stay. language you people that goes to school is it intimate or intimacy i don't know the closeness closeness <laughs> uh -huh. the, i've noticed the closeness mama we are just friends nothing is happening huh? she is lovely's friends that we are close uh -huh. that is all that is all mama roland ma. <laughs> um cynthia is somebody's wife Always remember that she's married. Married? When? <laughs> she's not. She's not married, Mama. She's not married. She's just living with a guy in the house. I'm sure they must have told you now. Even the house. I heard that it's the it's sometimes the house. The house. It's not the man. So. Uh, even at that though, no matter what, eh, you might not be having that uh, feelings for her, but she's the one. She might be the one that is having the feelings because I've noticed oh, the way she wow. looks at you, the way she behaves whenever she sees you. I don't know how you it now. I used to see everything. I woke here, but I don't know how you Headmaster was once a student, though, in case you don't know. Yes, Mama. I've heard you. Yeah? Yes, I've heard you. What did I say that you've heard? Yeah. Hey, you know, I just asked you a question. You said you've heard, you've heard. Okay, just you listen know. to me. Okay. Okay. Talk less yes, and listen more. Yes, I'm listening. Good. No matter what you do, be careful. Okay. Yeah, we do that, but I'm going to run out of all that glitters are not good. Yes. This taste of the pita cola in the mouth is different from the uh, the 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 this one. That one. That one. That it's not the same. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma eh? yes ma no, you, ma no problem. You can go. I can go down. You can go. <laughs> Thank you, Mama. Thank you. Mama. Drop the seat back. I will put it back, Mama. <laughs> mama. Alright, Mama. Eh? Roland. No problem. I've heard you. Uh, As soon as I receive your call, I have to rush down and come and see you. What's going on? Mm. 
glory, I'm facing some major problems in my home. Some time ago, Cynthia brought her friend to the house. And ever since she came, she has been doing everything. She just, she just, she just wants me by all means. What do you mean by she wants you by all means? She's been doing everything within her power to sleep with me and probably marry me. Are you serious? And what has Cynthia said about this? Have you told her? You see, that's the problem here. That's the main issue. I've been trying. I've been trying to tell her. I've been trying to explain to her. Trying to make her see reasons. But then she has, I, I think it's because of the trust they have for each other or something. She trusts us so much that she doesn't believe me. She has turned deaf ears to all my pleas and explanations. I would advise that you be very careful about this. Just be careful, please. Oh. Shante. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What? Not, what's you up? You again? After all they've done to you, you still don't want to quit? You know I can't quit on you. Men like us don't quit. I can never quit on you. What exactly do you want? What is it now? I've told you before, what I want is you alone in my life. I want you in my bed. I want you in my arms. Never! Don't. That will not happen. For crying out loud, I'm a married woman. So stop disturbing me. Calm down, calm down. <laughs> Don't worry. It's Nina Dozeo in this town. I will get you. Don't worry. Me, I will get you. It's just time I will take me. What rubbish. You mean that guy has been disturbing you all those while and you did nothing about it. Why? It's not as if I kept quiet. I told Chris. And on one occasion, he handled it. But Roland has been the one helping me out all this while. You mean that's the same guy that has been threatening the life of my brother? What? What do you mean by that? See, I do not know what you girls are talking about. But when have you girls became this soft? Back then in the US, you girls were not like this. See. I have a plan. I came back with my gun. Hey, hey calm down. All we have to do is just to look for this guy and pay him a visit. Shoot him and get close. No, 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 no. Please, 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 please. Oh. Chantel, that is not a good idea. Please, be cool. <laughs> eh? Girls, don't worry. I will handle it. I'll figure it out. Oh, now you will figure it out. Chantel, that was a terrible idea. Terrible idea! Please, I beg of you, allow Cynthia to handle this situation. Then we can pick it up from there. Shoot the guy. Whatever. Can I have some whiskey? No! Please? Not in this house. You girls are so boring. Well, I'm just trying to help. Help? You can suit yourselves. You're looking for who? You want to drink whiskey? You want to shoot somebody? You want to put somebody in trouble? I am just trying to help! Come on! Okay, ma. Uh, later now. Uh, Read that for me, I beg. Uh, Good afternoon. Hey, hey, hey. I I think I've met you somewhere before. Oh, okay. I'm Roland. Um, Lovelyn's cousin. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. How are you and um, Lovelyn? Yeah, we're all fine. We're all fine. Well, uh, I have to go meet Cynthia. Lovely uh, asked me to give something to her, so oh. I have to quickly hurry up and give it to her. Okay? Okay. okay. Oh, wait, wait. Hold on. Why don't you just tell her you love her? I don't understand what you're saying. <laughs> I know you would not understand. You see, you, you, you just have to tell her you love her and you might be lucky. She might tell you she loves you back. <laughs> 
But Cynthia is just my cousin's girlfriend. And I got to know Cynthia from my cousin, so there is nothing going on between me and her. By the way, Cynthia is married. What would I be doing with a married woman knowing <laughs> fully well that she's married? Huh? You must think I'm a kid, right? Well, I'm not, darling. You see, um, Cynthia is not married. She's just hanging out with Chris. And if anybody comes to ask her out, she would definitely accept. So, think about it. I have somewhere I have to be. Bye. Why does everyone think I'm dating Cynthia? Put them in your hands, though. 